Hey guys, if you ever want to carry the game, but you don't want to farm too much and just want to constantly fight, then consider using Chang'o. Usually, whenever I use her, I end up getting more kills and dealing more damage than the hyper carry. Welcome to In this game the enemy has Hanzo. Usually, Hanzo's player loves to steal the buff in the early game. Smash them. So since Franco is covering the bottom bush, I went to the top one instead, but he just kept following me. He probably didn't think that I was trying to prevent Hanzo from stealing our buff. There he is. Now I don't have to worry about the buff being stolen anymore. I actually got distracted reading the chat. Actually, this was done on purpose to show you that you should not get distracted by the chat and only focus on the game. This Franco is typing in front of the enemy. Is this bravery or insanity? My ultimate is about to be up, I thought maybe I could use it first before going back to heal. Let's clear the minion wave instantly, so we can push the turret before the enemies come stop.
This Yi Sunshin actually gave me the buff. Is he an active viewer? Just look at this insane amount of damage. If only Yi Sunshin ulti a little bit sooner, Selena would have died for sure. I think Yi Sunshin and Chang'e makes a great combo with their ultimate. Hard to escape from the ultra slow. I wanted to fully commit on the kill, but then I took a quick look at the map and I saw that nobody from my team was nearby. Remember, before fully committing to a kill, always take a quick look at the map and check the enemy and your teammates positioning. Poor Henzo, he's going to receive the full pew pew treatment. Since my skills are on cooldown and the enemies are being distracted by my teammates, I'm going to use this opportunity to focus down the turret instead. This Franco is absolutely fearless. Since we have such a huge advantage, I thought we should keep pressuring the enemy instead of waiting for the Lord. Chang U has such an insane movement speed that it's going to be quite hard to catch her unless she gets stunned. While Yi Sunshin is soloing the Lord, I will try to keep distracting the enemy and make sure they don't have a chance to get close to it. Since Franco is being so fearless, I decided to play ultra aggressively as well.
I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing. Thanks.